Good evening, everyone. This is Keeping It Real on WRGG 93.7. My name is Chantel, and I'll be discussing various health and wellness topics with you all each and every Sunday evening from 6 to 6.30 here on WRGG 93.7. You guys might say, well, Chantel, what is wellness? You know, I feel pretty good. I feel fine. You know, my body is willing and able to get up in the morning and go about my day, and I'm able to complete my tasks. Well, wellness consists of seven dimensions. Physical wellness, emotional wellness, intellectual wellness, social wellness, spiritual wellness, environmental wellness, and occupational wellness. Now last week, well, the week before last, we discussed a form of social wellness, which was effective communication. Okay, so today we are going to discuss... um, a type of wellness that uh, is based on your environment and uh, it helps with your emotional wellness and physical well-being. So right now we will go to another song selection by Avant featuring Kiki Wyatt, You and I, and we'll come back and talk about this wonderful wellness product. I want to talk about the one I love. I know a lot of times we forget how they take good care of you, but tonight, I just want to express the way I feel. Oh, baby, funny how things have changed in my life now, whether near or far, I want to be where you are. But when it comes to you, you're all that 
Okay, you guys. So tonight's product, um, wellness product is essential oils and some of the benefits and uh, helping us achieve wellness. So essential oils can uh, benefit us physically, emotionally, and environmentally. All right. Now, essential oils are a uh, balance of pure aromatic and infused oils, okay, that can help you um, experience, you know, with the right concoction, it can help you experience a restful sleep, and it can help you even fall asleep faster. Um, for those of us that uh, have issues with insomnia and, um, you know, sometimes you, you, you can't help but play back in your mind, you know, some of the things that you've gone through throughout the day and your mind is still racing when it's time to go to bed, um, you know, you could have a, a diffuser and um, put a couple drops of essential oil in that diffuser and let the, um, the, the aroma and the, the fumes fill your room while you're sleeping and, or while you're laying down trying to sleep. And um, it promotes you, it encourages you to take deep breaths in and out to kind of fill your lungs and help um, relieve some of the stress of the day and help you fall asleep faster. You can also uh, use essential oils for those of you that suffer from migraine headaches, okay? And I am definitely one um, that can testify to the, um, the benefits of essential oil when it comes to migraines. My son, he, uh, he suffers from uh, frequent headaches and sometimes they do turn into migraine headaches. Um, he does have a rescue medication that he takes for his migraines, but prior to it even progressing to a migraine, we turn we our go-to is the essential oil. Um, he applies some of it on his temples and the back back of his ears, and that um, helps relieve uh, some of the pressure from the headache. Um, it makes it more um, manageable, um, makes it more tolerable. So, you know, I don't know about you guys, but, um, you know, I really don't like the idea of introducing um, any kind of uh, medications or drugs into my children's system. So I prefer to go the natural way first and then, um, you know, take that, if, if necessary, to take some medications for it. But first of all, first and foremost, we try to do all natural benefits. So another um, all natural benefit to essential oil, and I'm pretty sure... Some of you may not know this. The environmental benefit of it um, is it can work as a pesticide and a bug repellent. Okay, um, I know for sh definitely uh, peppermint oil helps with uh, if you have rodent problems. You know that's a, a better, more natural way to deal with um, rodents in your home. If you um, you know, especially if you have little children, you don't really want to put down anything that may be harmful for them. So uh, you could put the peppermint oil right on the baseboards of your home on the floors and uh, those rodents, they cannot stand that smell. Also, there uh, is another bug type of bug repellent. Um, all of us may know about eucalyptus oil that helps with um, bug repellent. Also, um, cinnamon bark as well. Um, I know my son was doing a Boy Scout camp. I sent him with some cinnamon bark and of course his peppermint oil and um, he applied that. Um, before, well, after he took a shower to lay down and go to bed with, and he didn't come home with any mosquito bites all over his legs and arms this year, so that was a wonderful thing um, that I did not have to experience, and I was happy about that. But um, yes, we have, um, I have so many different, um, there are so many different remedies and um, different mixtures of essential oils that you can use that can help from anything from anxiety um, stress relief, help you relax, help you focus, you know, help, um, brighten, you know, wake you up in the morning and, and, and refresh you. So it is definitely beneficial to, uh, do some more research when it comes to essential oils and find out, you know, what, what, uh, blend would work best for you and your, your day-to-day -day struggle of, you know, trying to achieve your seven dimensions of, of wellness. You know, because that is the ultimate goal that we all want to be, you know, we want to feel good, but we also want to actually, you know, we want we want to be healthy. We, we want to be well. So wellness is not just a physical thing. Wellness is, like I said before, there are seven dimensions of wellness, okay? And your environment plays a, a huge part in that. Um, and, of course, our physical and then 
you know, the, the, um, the emotional as well. So if you're not emotionally well, then regardless of how your body will eventually start to, you know, that tension, you know, from not being emotionally well will start to build up maybe in your shoulders, you know, in your neck, you know, you may experience more headaches and things like that. So, um, that, those are telltale, telltale signs that our body gives to us and let it, letting us know that, Hey, there's a problem. So, um, I think if we kind of listen to ourselves and listen to our bodies and what it's trying to tell us as far as, um, our overall well being, you know, and, and take action when, uh, it could be something as simple as, you know, resting, having proper rest, you know, then you can, you can skip the doctor's office and you don't have to worry about, you know, taking all these medications and things like that. So it's good if you listen to your body. Um, I do have a, um, I know I put out, um, on our Facebook page on the keeping it real Facebook page, uh, a call to all home-based business owners that would like to take advantage of any type of free advertisement. I would be willing and, um, I would welcome, uh, anyone to send me a direct message on keeping it real, keeping it real WRRG Facebook page. And send me in that message. You can you can uh, paste a link to your home based business if it is well health and wellness related, and uh, we can go ahead and schedule a um, one Sunday that you can call in and you know discuss your product with us and you know share all, share wonderful information with people to help them in their battle to health and wellness becoming um becoming healthy and well. Um, I have a uh, a link to a home based business by the name of Young Essential Oils. There's a link on my uh, posted on the Keeping It Real Facebook page, and um, they have a list of essential oil products and different blends. If you like to um, click on that and um, take a look at that website, I'm gonna hopefully I can get in touch with the um, bit, the owner of that home based business and have her give us a call or. We can give her a call maybe hopefully next Sunday so she can share with you um, the different products that she has available and the different blends that she would recommend for whatever issues that you may have. Um, but she is also accessible on Facebook and her, a link to her home-based business is on my uh, Keeping It Real Facebook page. Um, I have had uh, quite a bit of a response when it comes to these the home-based businesses and them calling in and talking to us about uh, their products that they offer. So next week, um, we should, in the next coming weeks, we should have uh, plenty of things to talk about and discuss. And if you guys have any questions or any information that you would like to share um, about your experience with essential oils, or, you know, if you don't, if you don't think it's beneficial, if you think it's beneficial, you know, it's up to whatever your opinion is, I would love to, to hear it. And, um, you guys can feel free to uh, please do not forget to um, to like and follow us on uh, Keeping It Real on Facebook on Keeping It Real WRIG. Also, um, like and subscribe we on the YouTube page, Keeping It Real YouTube page. If you aren't able to listen in live um, right now, um, I also post the uh, the tonight show on our YouTube page. So free, feel free to check that out and don't forget to subscribe and like. Also, if you have any thoughts or any concerns or anything that you would like to share about today's topic or any um, previous topics that, that we covered, feel free to send me an email, keeping it real, WRGG at gmail.com. Um, so, yes, yeah, so I think, be, believe next week we may... Uh, discuss some environmental and occupational um, wellness and some products they may uh, that I've learned about that may help you with that. But um, you all uh, feel free to um, to comment, listen live, and you can send a comment and let everyone know, you know, that you are listening and chime in and, you know, let me know anything about uh, any kind of blends that you may use in your home, you know, for your uh, family or your own, even on yourself that has helped you um, with any kind of ailment or helped you achieve your uh, one of the seven dimensions of wellness. 
So um, I believe we are going to, yeah, we're going to go play, go ahead and play another song and then I'll possibly be back. You're broken down and tired of living life on the merry-go-round. And you can't find a fighter, but I see it in you, so we gon' walk it out. Move mountains, we gon' walk it out and move mountains. And I rise up, I rise like the day, I rise up, I rise unafraid, I rise up, and I do it a thousand eight times again. And I rise up, I like the waves, I rise up, in spite of the ache, I rise up, and I do it a thousand eight Silence is a quiet, and it feels like it's getting hard to breathe. And I know you feel like dying, but I promise we would take the world to its feet. Move, I won't dance, bring it to its feet. Hello, you guys, and we are back. Okay, so uh, that was a wonderful song. I love that song. That's my favorite song by Andrea Day, Rise Up. Um, so um, I have a gentleman here that can uh, testify to the benefits that he has experienced from um, having essential oils in his home, um, some of the things that has helped him with. Um, so I would like to introduce to you guys, Mr. Too Easy. Hey, how you doing, Miss Chantel? What's going on? I'm um, pretty good. Pretty good. How about yourself? I'm doing good. I can't complain. 
So I remember you talking about um, one time before to me that your uh, your wife put up these uh, air diffusers or something that kind of bothered you. Oh, yeah. Um, yeah, she's always trying new things. Um, so she bought this little brown air diffuser to, like, change colors. It was pretty awesome. You know, got the little purple, blue, yellow, orange. And um, I came in one day. I was like, what in the world is this thing? She was like, oh, this essential oils is going to make you sleep better and you know, so you might, you won't get the migraine. So I was like, okay, yeah, whatever. But um, it actually does make me sleep a lot better because, you know, um, I suffer from PTSD and other little stuff from combat. Mm -hmm. And I definitely can contest to the, um, diffu was it diffusers or infusers, whatever it's called? Diffuser, yeah. Diffusers, yeah, because yeah. it diffuses me. <laughs> so, um, yeah, it's, it's pretty cool. So um, if you're out there listening, um, if you're a veteran, if you're just a regular person, and you have uh, hesitation, at least try it once, you know. Yeah, yeah. They're, they're not that expensive at Walmart. They're, no. they're like 10 bucks, and yeah, it comes with some oil. Yeah, they're expensive, and they come yeah. with their own oil. Exactly, yeah, exactly. so I definitely would. I don't know if it comes with the color one like my wife has, but they got them in, in one of the aisles. Yeah, okay. So when you walked into the room, did you, did, like, did you smell anything different? Or, like, how did you notice? Oh, you just noticed the color, colors of the thing, and that well, was it. Well, you know, we have a lot of different smell good things in the house. So I'm basically, it caught my eye because mm. it was misting up. And I was like, what the hell is this on the dresser? <laughs> and then I looked at sort of colors. I was like, oh, God, here's another thing. But um, it actually does work. Um, you know, it's, it's it's wonderful. It's great. Okay, okay. Yeah. good, good, good. That's great. So there you go, you guys. There's a, there's a gentleman that can say that, you know, that he has... Uh, he has felt the effects of the essential oil, so it's not just some kind of snake oil. Nah, that... it's pretty good. It's pretty good. <laughs> yeah. Because, you know, yeah. I'm very apprehensive about a lot of stuff. Oh. You know, if you hear my talk show, you know I'm like, hey, that's stupid. But you don't want to try least... new things. Yeah, I'll try at least once. Okay, that's good. Yeah. That's wonderful. So he's a good sport about it. Oh, yeah. So, yeah, my, my like I said before you know, earlier before, my my son, he suffers from migraine headaches, and um, and uh, they the, the peppermint oil definitely uh, does help him. He even, well, I mean, uh, apparently it helps because he comes and asks for it at this point. So I'm assuming that it helps. So it is, that's from a, uh, a young man and a grown gentleman that can say that essential oils do actually work and they are helpful. Indeed. Yes. So that is a wonderful thing, you guys. So please do not forget to check, um, Check out the link that I have to the um, the home the essential oil home based business, um, ran by Miss Cherie. Um, hopefully next week I'll be able to get her on the show so she can talk to you more about her products. Um, and also uh, do not forget to uh, like and follow Facebook page Keeping It Real W R G G. Um, we are I'm also on YouTube Keeping It Real Keeping It Real W R R G on YouTube. And if you want to send me a message or you have something that you would like to share with me, you want me to share on the show next week or in the future, feel free to email me at keepingitrealwrgg at gmail.com. So uh, I think that is about it for, the, for today. So until next week, you guys, be good and take care of yourselves and take care of each other. And until we meet again, peace. It might seem crazy what I'm about to say Sunshine, she's here, you can take a break I'm a hot air balloon that could go to space With the air, like I don't care, baby, by the way huh. Because I'm happy Clap along if you feel like a room
Cause I'm 